All right, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a rectangle of a specific size and push pull it to a specific height. So I'm going to start off with my rectangle tool, and then I'm going to go over here and I'm just going to do a single click. I'm not clicking and dragging. So just a single click, and then I move my trackpad or mouse. And you'll notice that in the bottom right corner, the dimensions show based on how I'm moving it around. The apostrophe represents feet and the uh, quotation mark represents inches for those of you that don't know that. There's a comma in between the two um, different dimensions. So let's say I want to have a rectangle that's 30 feet by 40 feet. I'm going to start off by just typing and I don't need to go over here and click in that box. I can just start typing. So 30 apostrophe for 30 feet and then a comma 40 apostrophe and then I'm going to press enter or return and it's going to jump to that size. So that's a 30 by 40 rectangle. So let's say that's the size of a house or something. Now I'm going to go over to push pull and let's say I want to build a foundation that's like two feet high. So again, I'm not going to click and drag. I'm just going to do a single click and then I'm going to move my trackpad or mouse up and you'll notice that the distance is showing up on the bottom right corner. So we're around a foot right now. But if I start typing two, and the apostrophe for feet and press enter, it jumps to two feet. 